So is it just me, or is this one really long chapter, or are they splitting it up? Whoa. I grew tired of all this. What? If you refuse to cooperate, I will have no choice but to kill you. Of course, I will kill you regardless. But it could have been fast and painless. Instead, it will be a very, very slow. It's a good thing I love slow deaths, then. Bring it on. you one last time. Who do you work for? Where are you? Hey now. <clears throat> it's like Inception, man. It's completely deserted. It might be underneath. You sure it's here? We're right on top of the coordinates. The storm's getting worse. What do we do now? Hey, Jody, ask Aiden to find a shelter somewhere. You hear that, Aiden? All right, all right. is interesting we're gonna ski on down to this little old cabin in the snow three guys one girl and one spirit Village. Our informer duped us. That's what happened. Nope. I'm telling you. Down underneath us. Have to dig our frozen dead asses out of here. Three days walking on ice, eating snow for nothing. Fuck. I find the asshole that sent us here. Hey, I'm sick and tired of hearing you complain. <laughs> you have to say that. Shut the fuck up. You guys, I'm freezing. You think maybe we could build a fire first and argue later? She's right. We'll set up camp. Of course she is. I'll contact HQ and get instructions. C4. Fuck it. Everything's wet. Damn, all this stuff is soaking. We better find something. Or we won't make it to the night. Ah. Is it warm? gonna go out. I'm desperate for a pee. Do you really want to go out? Did you get a connection? No, it's gonna take some time with the storm. You're still angry with me, huh? Look, it, it probably won't make you change your mind, but I regret what happened. That's just what he wants you to hear. You're right. It doesn't make me change my mind. <laughs> uh, 
I'll help you guys out. Fucking genius. <laughs> Give me five, Vince. Did you see that, Jody? Yeah. That's great work, guys. You're welcome for the assistance, folks. Right, she said she wanted to go outside. Don't go too far, okay? It's minus 40. I don't plan on doing any sightseeing. <laughs> Holy crap, minus 40? I die within like seconds. I like the animation for a walking, it's so realistic. Not good. Mobile command center. Okay, music's picking up. That means action's about to go on. They're here. I saw them. Where? On the main road. A convoy of armored cars. They drove right by me. Did they see you? No. No, I don't think so. Let's roll. Let's go. Let's follow them. Inception style. I like this part of Inception when Tom Hardy's just rolling behind them and mowing them all down. Can we go faster, please? So much slowness. But yeah, it does look like we missed some chapters, like it didn't cut out. It was like old friends, the Nora Gray, and then now this is called Dragon's Hideout. I didn't go see what's inside. So that's kind of weird that they didn't do a loading screen for each one. And they might have done it because uh, chronologically they all happen simultaneously. Not simultaneously, but concurrently, whatever. They got that dragon flag. Is that a submarine? They're loading crates into submarines. Submarines? That means the rift is underwater, like I said. It's underneath them. I mean, there must have a, a base down there, and they're using the subs to shuttle supplies. I called it. How many soldiers? I can see three. Tell Iden to take them out. Iden? As you wish. So, Asian dude. We're gonna go take this guard out first. Wait. Wait. Get rid of the soldiers first. Yeah, isn't that one of the soldiers? But, uh, okay.
How shall we kill this guy? <laughs> Unsuspecting fool. I like his little Russian hat. I always call him Russian hats. I don't know what they're really called, but I remember in Little Big Planet Sackboy had a little get, can get that hat and like the Russian coat. It was just so badass. I love it. I think I have one of those hats in real life too. She feels that. What do we do now? Just give me a second, okay? We're gonna hijack a sub. I've piloted a sub like this on the CIA simulator. I mean, maybe we can use it. Yeah, sure, let's use their sub. They won't notice anything. I'm looking for a plan, not a way to commit suicide. What, what exactly are you doing? Finding a solution to the problem. Nice idea, but it won't fool them very long. Yeah, well, maybe not. But that fucking rift is not gonna shut down by itself, is it? Yeah, <laughs> okay. awesome. That might work from a distance. Then what? We take the sub down to the base. And then we take it from there. I'll go with her. What about us? It's a two-seater. You stay here, you find us a way out. By the time we get back, there's a good chance we're gonna have to move fast. What? Wait, that's in order, Nick. Listen to Ryan Clayton. He will put you in your place, Nick. Give me the explosives. This explains the little introduction, the cutscene with them held hostage. They get caught. You do realize we might not make it back alive, right? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, I've known that from the start. I want to be in one of those. Might be a blast, you know? Keep diving. The base shouldn't be far. Oh my god, this is awesome. Follow the lights on the ro rocks and on the radar. So we're going to turn right. Right there. Then we're going to go down. Just follow like the runway lights. That's what it reminds me of. Look at those fishies. Now we rise a little bit. Make a sharp right turn. There. You see the lights? Question. 
You and me both, because we're going to be screwed once we get in. Some good piloting, yo. I am impressed. Few men would have held that for so long. I ain't no men. Man. Oh, I am. She's not. Perhaps you will be more sensitive to your comrades. Pain. My questions are simple. I want to know your name. Who you work for. And how you learn of the existence of this base. Iden. Of course, you also have to tell me what happened when you crossed the containment field. You say nothing, you hear me? You know. Do not I'm talk. I'm going to ask the same questions over and over again until you answer them. What is your name? Cut his forearm. Come on, Iden, help. That looks... Painful. All you have to do is answer, and your comrade will not suffer anymore. Comrade. Still won't answer? I won't answer. What do I have to do to make you speak? Kill yourself. Perhaps you will not remain silent if I go a little further. Oh. That just sounds pretty bad. This is so unnecessary. You only have to answer and this nightmare will come to an end. No answering. Answer. I beg you. I hate to see people suffer for nothing. Suffer for nothing. It's kind of like a French accent. An urgent request demands my attention. I shall return soon to continue our interrogation. Uh, this ain't no conversation if no one's converse conversing back, yo. I'll stab you for your ribbons. Oh, another flashback to before they get captured. Now what? We find the condenser, destroy it, and get out. <laughs> and any idea how you plan to do that? No. <laughs> I'll figure something out. She looked like a midget there getting out. Mine. What? But it Just shut up and follow me. Christ, it worked. And now find the condenser before they realize something's up. You better salute me, boy, when I walk up to you with this general dude. That's what's up. The 
door over there. That must be the way. The condenser's close. I'm feeling echoes coming from the rift. This is too easy. I don't like it. Jody! Jody, what's happening? Oh wow, that's how to get caught? That simple? Time for I didn't do some work. Gotta break that field down. I do think it's interesting that he's actually separated from I uh from Jody. Your soul is mine, dude, Mr. Scientist. Oops. I need that guy. Come on. I know you do. I know. Can't pick up the weapon yet. Shut up, dude. Poor guy gets possessed like three times in a row. <laughs> I think he might suffer brain damage or eye damage from rolling his head up like that non-stop. I'm gonna whack that guy in the head and steal that gun. Oh! Hit his head. His head hits the <laughs> table. That's funny. And now, to finish it. <clears throat> See you later. Oh, crap. You better run. I died. I didn't attack. Oh crap, opening the containment field was probably a bad idea. Fire. All those entities. Heal you, or I'll heal you. I did. You made it. Yes, ma'am. Of course I did. Get me out of here. Full blast. Ryan. 
You ain't hiding back there, dude. You dead. Oh, come on. That's messed up. Can you walk? Yeah, I'm okay. Go back to the slopes. Wait for me. If I'm not back in 15 minutes, just go without me. Are you crazy? Yes, Look, she is. The base is destroyed. Let's get out of here while we still can. The rift is wide open. Entities are just going to come pouring out if we don't close it. It's too late, Joy. We got to go now. Then you go. There we go. That doesn't sound good. gonna go diving guess we are oh what the hell turning to a power ranger go go power rangers or gi joe He has no choice. That light don't help for nothing. But we gotta find this entity. An entity. What's that bridle? Oh, whoa. Somebody's dead right there. See it. Thought maybe I had to put a C4 there, but it looks like no. This one will be number two. Then this one should be number three. Really, the level of detail is so awesome. Like, you know, different environments. 
excuse me, like the way she walks in every different environment. Water, she's walking slow because she's wading through it. And so on and so forth. When she's in the snow, the skiing, just like stuff like that, it's just really awesome. That is a giant entity. Oh crap, we are running. Come on, must go faster. Must go faster. I made it. Get that heavy suit off. You're going to die here with me. Oh. The greatest discovery the world has ever known. Destroyed because of you, stupid American bitch. Block. Slap. Oh. Come on. Oh my god. Oh. She is strong. Oh. Come on, I hate these six axes shaking crap. Thank you, Entity. You actually saved me there. Is he laughing like a psychopath? No, you idiot. Oh, wrong way. Get off of me. Oh. What the hell? Pretty sure that means it's time to run. Oh crap. Get the hell off of me, dude. Come on, climb! CLIMB! <laughs> nice roll. We're almost there. Run! But he left. Damn it, Ryan! Where the fuck are you? You said 15 minutes. Hmm. 
Nope, he's there. You didn't think I'd let you down, huh? Kaboom. Burning staying in here and drowning. Might as well try. Where the hell's Ryan? Was I supposed to drag him out? Cause I hope not. It's gonna make me feel guilty as hell. Okay, there he is. Dude must be freezing wearing that kind of shirt in his eye. Oh, that pain. She ain't gonna return the favor, yo. So how about you? <laughs> Do you love me too? Yeah. Yeah, I love you, Ryan. Oh, I could have said no and went for Jay, Jay, but oh well. It's gonna be the coldest kiss in history. Should hug each other, keep each other warm. Damn, that'd be messed up if he dies right there. Come on, Aiden. Save him! There! It's them! Yeah, take your time. 